So for this first outfit, I literally just have on a Vans t-shirt. Um, ideally, I'd wear Vans with it, and it's a Kent State hat from my brother's college. This outfit is actually one of my favorites because I'm wearing my super high-rise, high-waisted jeans and this tiny shirt with a blue Adidas hat. <laughs> Now, I haven't worn skirts in a while, so I decided to wear this one with this cute little cross in the front tank top top. <laughs> um, there's little flowers on the skirt, and it's really pretty. In this one, the idea would be a smaller bralette underneath this green shirt. I feel like a reverse Kim Possible, um, but I thought the skirt was cool, and I kind of felt cool wearing it, so that's, that's that. <laughs> I don't really know where I was going with this, but ideally like a loose like t-shirt with that skirt and maybe a hat to, I don't know, cover up your bald spots, I don't know. Um, but the skirt has a weird thing on the side I thought was cool. And this is more of a girlier attempt to do something. This is another one of those like cross in the front tops with a cute little button down skirt. Uh huh, yeah, it's cool. Now this is another one of my favorite like outfits. All black underneath with a black and yellow flannel. Yeah, that's the word. Um, this one is just black jeans with a large oversized t-shirt. And this one has Kirby on it because Kirby is freaking dope. Another small top t-shirt with gray hat and black jeans. I don't know why I'm standing like that. And that's that. And then I'm wearing this cute little crop top. This is another one of my favorite outfits with these jeans that I ripped up in a different video of mine. Um... I felt pretty cool wearing it, not gonna lie. Um, and now I have freaking fishnets underneath of it with another cross in the front tiny top. The fishnets honestly make me feel really, really cool. So I thought it would be a nice fit, yeah. And here I go with my little star belt, just, you know, living. And then I have another fit where I'm wearing the same jeans, same fishnets underneath, but I'm also wearing a black top and a another flannel around the waist. Honestly, I thought this would be a good idea, and looking at it, it's not as great as I thought, but I thought it would be a good idea to wear, like, a t-shirt with these jeans, and I decided to switch it up with my Play Bunny, Play Boy Bunny shirt. Yes, it has Playboy Bunny on it, and the, you know, yeah. Um, this one's different, um, it's just a crop top with shorts and a red and white and blue flannel and a hat. Um, this shirt is actually really, really tiny. Um, <laughs> and then just a basic oversized t-shirt with jeans, jean shorts. I could wear jeans with them, I could not, you never know. Um, but I like this brand. Now this, I feel like I'm in a friggin' James Bond movie, or whatever reason, because the shirt is really tight and it's really cool. Um, it's a nice, like, warmer shirt for, like, when it starts to get cooler. Um, and then I decided to put a dress over top of it, and honestly, it looks cooler from far away. Now I switched the top to a sweater, like a more looser, like balloon arm sweater, question mark. Put the jeans back on. I could honestly wear any jeans with these and still look pretty cool to me. Um, but I really like this <laughs> sweater. And then I decided to put a skirt underneath of it to show, I guess, its flexibility with what you could wear with this sweater. And last but not least, this final outfit. I love this top. Um, I haven't worn it in a while, but I thought it would look really cool with this skirt because it's black in the top. Um, there's not really much to say about it. It's just lovely, and I really like it. 